Hello everyone, welcome to another Terraria tutorial video. Uh, in this video I will show you how to build Hell Farm. Uh, first thing you need to know about farming Hell is, well there is this problematic fact that the enemies are not affected by lava, so you need to find another way to kill them. And in this video I will be using spear traps. So let's get to it. First thing you need to do is actually a lot of terrain preparation. Uh, you will need to build this kind of a let's call it arena that will have two flat surfaces like for the bottom and for the ceiling and in the middle of this area arena there will be two pyramids one will be normal and the other will be facing it like ups and down right away the unit is two pyramids in order to guard your enemies inside this rectangular in the middle where will be the spears that will be killing them uh, it's really just the bottom pyramid is in order to guide the walking enemies and the upside down pyramid in order to is here is here in order to guide flying enemies like this simply they will just like that fall inside this rectangle and there will be the spears that will be cutting them down uh, before starting building this one I would like to show you how this work or uh, and I will show you show you show this on the surface so I will see you there in a minute So we are on the surface and here I would like to show you how this farm will be building actually works like. Uh, I believe that it's easier for you to see it here. So we have several of the spear traps placed upon each other. And we will have to turn them one by one in order to make this work perfectly. They, ha they have to be synchronized. And actually placing pressure plates like this on the platforms ensures that. They will in turn turn, turn these timers and it will make it simply work all the time. So here, here goes the first try, you simply just fall through it and it works how it's supposed to. Simply one by one it's throwing the spears, the accutators are turning off these blocks and it works how it's supposed to. You can see here that it goes pretty deep so you don't need to worry much about how big the your farm will be. So then just turn it off, you can turn it off just by running over it like this and it just stops how it's supposed to. Uh, here I will show you wiring. It looks slightly complicated, but really it's not. Everything that's done here, pressure plate is connected to the timer here, and then the, in the same way it's connected to the set of the spikes, sorry, spear traps. And simply this is done here five times over, that, that's why there's so many wires. But it's really just this pressure plate connected to the timer and then connected to the spear traps with the accutators on it. So yeah, I'll just turn it on so we can see it again. But really, this is all we want to do now in the hell. So now we are going back to hell and we are going to build this how it's supposed to be. So we are in back in hell and I already have this construction fully prepared. I just need to really place everything in the order to make it work. Uh, this way this video won't take long and you will get basic load of information you probably might need for building this kind of farm. So first thing first, I will set up the teleporter inside that base. I'll place it here. With blue pressure plate on it. Now blue pressure plate is very useful because just player can activate it. So this way you ensure that no enemies will be teleported inside of your base. Anyway, I will place this fire here. And I already have this place ready for teleporter. And I'll just get inside, kill this bed off. And I will get it all the way here. Here will be another teleporter. And again, the blue pressure plate. I need to connect it a bit higher. Works. Okay, this works. So, this is the first step. Now, what I need to do, we can place another blue pressure plate that will be activating the spear traps. So, this one, two, three, four. Okay, I prepared here the four block space, so I will have four spear traps. Or four lines of spear traps upon each other. So this is done. Now I need to take a timer. Wait, I'll just place it somewhere here. But no, I might need this one. What I don't need? I don't need teleporter anymore. So I'll place a second timer. One second timer here. We can't do that. Sorry for that. Forget about this one. So I need to place some wall here. They got to be placed on the wall. So I got to just change this a little bit. I need four of them here. So I've got to build it light, slightly bigger. We'll be having one here. Can have another one here. One here. Uh, this is probably not great. So I'll do the other way around, like this. This is much better. 
and we place those timers here. One, two, three, four. That's what we need. I can run already this yellow branch with this this yellow wire. Sorry, it will go here, and then we just got to follow it up to the to our spear trap. So it goes like that. There, I would like to make it a little bit of uniform. Whatever this will do. Uh, now you got to remember that the first, that your first platform, sorry, the first pressure plate will be turning the first line of the spear traps. That's that simply must. It got to be in the order. You can do it any way around. So simply, this will be activating the first set of the spear traps like this. Got to just clear this up slightly. Want to make it look nice. Okay, there we go. I can already place actually this. Wait, I will. You know what? I will just place all the spear traps here. They can just be here. We'll just then need to connect them. Wait, give me this one. This will be the easier way to do it. Can go slightly lower. Okay, there we go. One line, a second line, and this is third line, and the fourth line. There we go. Wait, I need you here too. I won't be placing actuators just yet. Uh, they can mess up your farm slightly, so I like to place them by the end. So now we got the second line. I'll use different color this time. Let's say green. And we just got to follow. We'll follow alongside of it. Sort of. Okay, sorry. This wasn't supposed to happen again. There we go. Yeah, the only problem here is hell that you will be harassed all the time by enemies. Whatever, whatever. If you have good harmonic gear, you will do just fine. Okay, I will place it all the way here. So another set is connected. I need to switch to another different set, different kind of branch. So let's. We didn't use blue yet, so I will use blue now. And we do just the same thing. Wait, I don't want to be turning this on yet. But yeah, that, that's what will happen. Whatever. Wait, hopefully we didn't connect the other one right now. I'll just use use this and I'll cut this green here so it's not messing up. Okay, we did it again. Oh wait, I used the green one, sorry, my bad. So I got to switch, I, I have to use the blue one. And I need to avoid this switch down there, sorry, pressure, pressure plate. There we go, leave me alone, all of you. I take blue French right now and I just follow alongside of them. Let's try not to connect them, make it nice so we can see what's going on. Okay, so this is the other set of the spear traps done. Now do I have another French? Oh no, I can use already one I used already. Wait. Yellow. Oh I didn't use red. Okay. I usually use red as the first. Whatever. Oh and turn it on again. I don't want to do that yet, so yeah, again, we we'll have to run through the timer and run alongside of this wire here. Uh, for, hopefully it's fully connected because I can see it already. Wait, I want to turn it off, it's if possible. So wait, I'll just... Okay, we can turn it off like this. Now we got to connect the second set. So we are going up here again. Like this. And we are connected to this fourth set. Wait, this one started to hit me pretty hard, so I would rather get rid of him. Okay, now we have four of four lines of the spear traps connected. So we can actually already place the actuators. So let's do it now. Start with the top line. Wait, it's too far away for me to place the actuator, so I will have to cut through it. I'll just place it here. Probably. Wait, give me a second. I'll get rid of this one. Here it's too hard. Even in hard mode or end game armor, he it's already pretty hard. Okay, I'll get rid of this line of traps so I can place this actuator right here. And we don't need this one, but whatever, it can be here. Now I'll have to replace the spear traps again. Where do I have them? Right here. Good. So I will be placing them right here again. Just where I get to them out. 
Wait, arrow spears. Wait, I want to avoid this one. He could kill me already. So I need accutators again. Leave me alone. You too. Where do I have accutators? Oh, I have here. Okay, I didn't sew them. So you place them all the way there. Now, the time has come. Wait, I'll just clean this out. Don't want to have this one out. This could cause a mess. So I can already barricade myself inside this house. So let's just place it here. And let's see if this works. So I just run through these buttons. And the spear traps are already going up and down. So yeah, this is basically working. This is all I wanted to do here. So already this farm is fully working, but... What you can do to improve it, of course, is water candle. I believe I took some. Where did I put them? Oh, there they are. So, you can place them here. But problem with this farm is that now imps can get inside. But you can do something about this one. Oh, here he is. Talking about the devil. You can again put you to use some accutators and place them all over the place. Sort of will start doing this. Hopefully this will work out. I didn't try it. But it should. You can just cover this in the ash blocks. All this place. But you need to place accutators already upon it. This might take a little while. And you can connect these accutators. And I probably... You need just one, two lines really. You can spawn on such a small area. So I'll get rid of these accutators here. And I will connect them all. Should use some wire I didn't use here. I probably use them all, so I'll use just the red one. Doesn't really matter. And do I have switch? Okay, I'll place that switch here. So it's always when I'll, I'll be standing right in this place. So I'll just connect this here. Like this. And now I can walk through. So it does already do what it's supposed to. I'll just place it now all over the place. I uh, don't need this one. So yeah, basically you just cover this all in the ash, ash blocks. And connect it to the wire. Sorry, placed accutators on it. This actually now won't do. Because you always need to have it turned on. So I'll go like this. Turn this on. Now I can place the accutators. And turn them all off. Wait, what happened? Oh, I didn't have them on wire. So I need to return this. And connect them all to the wire. So basically like this, you just have to... You just have to put this all over your farm here. And the imp will not be able to spawn in here. Okay, now I'll turn it off. Because there's another problem. The imp can be spawned on these places here and here. And you can easily re re get rid of them with simple dart trap. So I'll show you how to do it. It's just really, you know, place your dart trap in this place. Wait, I'll just pick it up. Do I have it? Hopefully I do. Okay, there we go. You need to... Oh, wait, this guy. Oh, it's pretty hard. Got to get rid of him. Yeah, he almost killed me. Do I have potions? Probably didn't take any. Doesn't matter. I'll have to survive somehow. So play this dart trap here. And I need, to, again, put Accutator in front of it. Now, wait, I am running from here for a while. Can do it from here. Um, now, I need to connect some of these to the trap. Wait, need to, I need to build it correctly. I need to think now for a while. Because this red trap will be turning this block. So, yeah, I can put this, this one, this red, to the dot trap. And now I need that blue one to, you, to be put on the accutator. So, let's run it all the way here. And just put it on the accutator. I'll just turn it, out, turn it on, see what it do. If it's working how it's supposed to. Shoot it out, close it in. Let's see again. Okay, so this is basically all you need to do here. And this farm is basically ready. So you just, yeah, as I said, you just finish this discovering up. And you got all you need for this hell farm. And here is the trap fully built. 
yeah, the, so there I have the switch that turns on all the accutators and the straps so I can walk around or just can lock myself in so the imps is not spawning anywhere in here. He probably still might be spawning here, but I, I probably can live with that. Even uh, some mimics got killed here. But yeah, anyway, I'll show you the, the, the wiring, how it looks like. Wait, I will open it. And this is how it looks in the final. Just really a lot of... This looks quite crazy, but it, it's just accutators played around the ash block. So yeah, so this is the end of this video. I hope you that you find it useful, and I will see you in the next one.